Okay, so Amberlyn Reed. Someone who I've spoken about a year ago on this channel. A woman who's fond of scams, audience manipulation, delusion, and cruelty. Today there's a lot on our plate, a whole table full to explore the types of different tastes of Amberlyn Reed. Uh. So without further ado, you are indeed watching the Curtis Price channel that offers commentary without the depression. And without further ado, welcome to my dinner party. So ladies and gentlemen, Amberlynn Reed. Now recently, if you didn't know, there's a lot been going on with Amberlynn. She's all over the place. People accusing her of trying to sabotage her ex-girl Becky. Also, there is a new girl in Amberlynn's life. Amberlynn's got a new... Okay. Four years it took me to find my current girlfriend. Not to show off, love. And also, Amberlynn has taken extreme measures to show the amount of responsibility she has created. Who am I kidding? There's absolutely none. And also, Becky, Amberlynn's ex-girlfriend, hit back with some really powerful shots. So, so if you are excited for today's episode, make sure you do hit the like button, comment for the algorithm, and of course, subscribe to get me to 100k. I want it. I need it. I already have it. And let's begin, ladies and gentlemen, with a fantastic clip from Amberlynn Fail. Do you take any responsibility for the community you've created? Absolutely fucking not. I do not. And I say that with my chest. Literally with my chest. I did not create this community at all. Not one bit. This community created itself and has now involved me in their subject matter. I did not ask for it. I did not pick it out. I'm not the head honcho. I do not condone it. I don't agree with it. I don't support it. It's not my community. I don't talk to them. I don't talk with them. Nothing. They simply just talk to me on here. I'd love to block y'all, but I can't block y'all. Physically impossible. I'm, I'm, it's not my community, it's not me. It's not me as a person, nothing. Um, and to be told that I created you guys is absolutely insane to me. Like, it is very creepy, <laughs> honestly. Like, a lot of you give me the actual creeps, I'm gonna be, like, absolutely honest here. To be told that I created you guys is absolutely insane to me. Well, Amberlynn, quite an interesting hole you've dug yourself there, but don't worry, my mind is still young. I'll remember that. And I also want you, ladies and gentlemen, at home to remember this statement from Amberlynn Fail, because in a moment, Amberlynn Trust is gonna reveal all of the leftovers. Another pun? Who wrote this? I did. <laughs> I wrote it. So Amblin being told that she created you guys is absolutely insane to her. In other words, referencing her viewers as the community she apparently didn't create. Okay, well, I'll be honest. I don't really believe you. You started this community the day you were made, and that's November 8th, 2013. And in case you're not the brightest, that is the day you first uploaded on the very hopeful channel you created. And some of you might be watching this confused, but don't worry, because this is about to explain all of who Amberlynn Reed is. The Amberlynn Reed of success, motivation, and drive that she began when she first started her weight loss journey, which drove the very community she had created. But now she's not responsible for the way things have turned out, of course. So let's see what Amberlynn trusts has to show us. I to film this because today is the last day that I'm gonna be eating like this. Day one, day five was an absolute fail and I'm just excited to wake up tomorrow and put yesterday and today behind me. Day seven, it's gonna be Monday, fresh start. Tomorrow is a new day. Starting tomorrow. Starting tomorrow. Tomorrow, I really wanna do this. I swear, tomorrow is Monday. It's Monday. Anything that bad that happened over the weekend or over the week, it's a fresh new day. Starting Friday. Right, well, that's milking the teat at this point. You are milking the teat. Continue to milk it or be destroyed. <laughs> we'll take your arms, your legs, and then your face. <laughs> so Amblin Trust just exposed Amblin Fail, ladies and gentlemen. Allow me. <sighs> Let's begin. So ladies and gentlemen, what exact? So what exact? Really? Every- Get out. Get out. So what exactly, ladies and gentlemen, is going on here? And most importantly, did Amblin Reed create this community? Well, she's mastered the art of audience engagement, ladies and gentlemen, by using manipulation. Amblin Reed will promise her viewers a weight loss journey. With her starting a weight loss journey, with her viewers to ride along with her, eventually that journey will come to an end, i.e. Amblin Skinny. And with that in mind, there will be no motivation or any reason to watch Amblin Reed anymore. I came for the weight loss journey, and she succeeded. So what she once started as a weight loss journey, led to became something entirely different. Fail after fail after fail, and Amberlynn has progressively gotten bigger and bigger. I'm sorry, Amberlynn, but it's time to stop. What's behind me? What is it? <laughs> Amberlynn Reed purposely fails her weight loss journeys, therefore her audience will always continue watching. And some people on the internet, they like to watch people's downfalls. So through Amberlynn Reed constantly failing and a little bit of audience manipulation, some of her audience actually feel sorry for her 
for the fact that she can't actually lose her desired weight. They feel terribly sorry for her. Swan Berlin, you created the blueprint, therefore you created the entire community. Oh, and apparently Amberlynn has actually progressed recently. She's lost 30 pounds. Yay! No, she hasn't. She's put on 30. However, at the start of the year, Amberlynn Fake said this. And it's been going pretty good. So the first thing I want to talk about is how much weight I want to lose in 2021. I always set goals for myself and never succeed in them. But there's always that one point when you might actually succeed. I always set goals and never succeed. But there's always that one point where I might actually succeed. No, 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 no. Your sentence is all wrong. You may as well have accepted failure already. Accepting the fact that you always fail when you set goals is only placing a self-made barrier on yourself, keeping you from actually succeeding. Spiritual Curtis right here. I might not seem it, but I love all the law of attraction, the universe, the spirituality, even the crystals. And that's the point where you click off. You hate me. I get it. That is a crystal. And also, ladies and gentlemen, you can't set a goal, but then the next day, eat a cheesecake. <laughs> When's that ever worked? No, sorry, but then a couple of months later, she uploaded a video explaining why she's still gaining weight. Wonderful. <gasps> Fuck my face, all right? And now, of course, ladies and gentlemen, on to the main course. Ah, good evening, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Dr. Don Valentine. And here we are in my ship, currently traveling through a black hole. Don't ask why. Bollocks. They are Clive. So recently, ladies and gentlemen, Becky and Amberlynn have indeed separated. And apparently, ladies and gentlemen, people are saying that Amberlynn Reed does indeed have a new wifey. That's the meme right now. <laughs> and also, apparently, she's purposely holding Becky back. So I thought that would be a good place to start. Alright, so... Do you want to tell them? Okay. Um... I guess I'm gonna go ahead and just say it. Um, we had broke up. It happened Sunday. And it was initiated by me. But the, th the fact of the matter is, is I've had a lot of time to think and reflect. And we just want different things in life. And, but I love her. I. I love her. Now, it was pretty emotional, but it didn't take Amberlynn Reed long to find a new wifey. Amberlynn Reed has recently changed her Instagram bio to a honey emoji with the word taken next to it. Ricky, already? She will, you're not seeing this right. And people are asking, was she making it up? Did she fall in love with a Chinese takeaway? And Amberlynn Reed has no problem showing off her Ricky's in front of the live stream just to show the audience, look, guys, I'm getting some action. People who do that don't usually get much action. And this is what Becky had to say when she fired back a mouthful. I don't know. We loved each other. Yeah, but it wasn't in love. Do you think you're in love now? Do you think she's in love with you? That's a very nice feeling. Congratulations. I've never had that. Oh, you got him! Becky just told Amberlynn that she was never in love. Oh my god. But it is, however, very different to what you were saying earlier. I don't know how much that really says about you. And that smug smile as well. Really, Amberlynn? Really? But now see this, my friends. We actually do know who Amberlynn Reed's new wifey is. <sighs> it's this account. Yeah, it's this one, apparently. Uh, nice. Cool. Apparently the account's name is Jade. Whether that's her, her wifey's name, I mean, probably. And here, once again, ladies and gentlemen, is Becky vaguely confirming that Amberlynn Reed's wifey is Jade. Jade. I got it. I got you, no one. I love you. So I love her too. Oh, again, again! Amberlynn literally thinks her life is a joke at this point. But now I can manifest these nuts, I now can sleep easier at night knowing Amberlynn Reed's dating life. But what makes her an even better person, ladies and gentlemen, is how Amberlynn Reed may or may not have lied to Becky to keep her financial success at bay. Since you want to be first, Amberlynn, you can have it all. How many more watch hours do I need? I don't know, I think I was at like 20 something the last time I checked, and I think you have to have 100,000. I'm at 20,000 something. I'm sure Amberlynn can help me with all this, but I don't know. Is she still lying? What? But it's only four? This is stuff that Becky could have just researched, but she didn't. And I'm asking myself, I'm speculating to myself, did Amberlynn Reed tell her there needs to be 100,000 watch hours? Because that's a long ass time. Almost as long as we've been waiting Amberlynn Reed to get on her weight loss journey. But did Amberlynn Reed tell her that? Why would she? Why would she? No. <laughs> 
No. 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 Well, I think that takes the cake from Glen Reed, ladies and gentlemen. But speaking of cake, I hope you're not full because, ladies and gentlemen, I can announce the best part of the day. It's time for dessert. Best bit. Best bit. So welcome to the best bits, ladies and gentlemen. Now you might be asking, Curtis, why would I watch to the end to see the end bits? Well, it's not just the end bits, ladies and gentlemen, but it's the best bits that were so good. How to keep it to the end of the video. So our first, you want to start off with the uh, Amberlyn Trust, ladies and gentlemen, showing how trustworthy and a wonderful, lovely person she is. And one thing I admire about Amberlyn Trust is that she's always honest. She always shows the true colours of the real Amberlyn Reed. Let me show you what I'm talking about. I like myself perfectly fine. I just don't like you because you're inconsistent and you gaslight your audience and mistreat others. Okay. <clears throat> Let's say I do gaslight my audience. Who freaking cares? Oh. oh my God. I'm going to spend zero seconds recovering from that. I cared so much about what you said that it didn't hurt at all. So as we can see, ladies and gentlemen, that is indeed Amberlyn Reed just telling everyone that she doesn't care that she, you know, manipulates or gaslights, whatever she said. She doesn't care. I really do admire your sense of adventure. Uh, just going through all the holes, you know? One time, oh, bullshit, me crying, I'm, uh, and then the next time it's, I don't care, I manipulate them. <laughs> Spot on. And personally, I would rather know what you guys at home think of what you just said, rather than me. Because, uh, I don't really watch Amberlyn Reed's channel, to be honest. I'd get depressed otherwise. Best bits. Best bits. Okay, so what happened next was apparently, uh, Becky's obviously got her channel now, and she's trying to grind for that monetization, you know, 100k watch hours, you really need to... And it appears that, uh, Amberlyn Reed and Becky, their channels compared one aside another, Turns out Becky's having more likes than Amberlyn Reed. Don't know whether I want to laugh or cry. <laughs> I chose laugh. That's it. I chose laugh. After all, Amberlyn Reed has been doing this for years. You know, for years and years since like 2013. What I do admire about the stage is how Becky literally gave Amberlyn a taste of fuck you. <laughs> That's what she had. Yeah, it was. Now it's Becky's turn to take the throne, ladies and gentlemen. And you know what? Hashtag Team Becky. I don't know. I don't know if I should actually. Best bit. Best bit. Recently, ladies and gentlemen, in Amberlynn's neighborhood, a gunshot went off. You guys all know because um, I put take it. <laughs> I just heard a gunshot. Did you guys hear that? Love that. Okay. Yeah, that was definitely a gunshot. Or perhaps it could have been the cause of the Chick fil A that Amberlynn Reed consumed a few hours before that. Uh, but sure, yeah. That was a gunshot. You mad, bro? Uh, yeah. I said, tell me what you mad for. Uh, you mad, bro? Uh.